Hi, today I'm going to give you a small tutorial how to unlock a BlackBerry. Any BlackBerry, uh, any curve, any bolt, or any model, which I don't, I haven't described. Well, I'm going to use this box, Furious, Furious Gold. Activated the BlackBerry, this box. Yeah, um, I'm going to unlock Nokia, uh, BlackBerry 8520. It has been locked to T-Mobile UK network. I'm going to unlock it. Right. First thing I need to have is the previous gold box. I'm going to connect it with the, with the system. And now I'm going to open the previous gold software, which unlocks BlackBerry. And before that, I have to open the maintenance. All right. Um, <clears throat> Blackberry has been included in the pack four so I'm going to update pack number four you must have internet connection for for this process and as you can see it's going to update the pack number four and it can take up to two minutes right once it updates I'm going to attach the Blackberry by opening the BlackBerry code reader. In the meanwhile, I'm going to tell you how to how to see that the BlackBerry is has been locked or unlocked to any network. Right, first of all, I go in the menu, then I go into advanced menu. First, I have to go to the options, and then I go into advanced options. Then I go to SIM card, okay, and it says no valid SIM card. So I press M E. P D. So here, here you get the uh, status of the uh, locks. So there is a network lock still active. Rest all the locks have been disabled. So we need to unlock the network code. Right. Let's see where is the software. Right. Software is almost raising the dongle. And it could take up to 30 seconds more. Right, the update is finished, and now it's ready to unlock a BlackBerry. I'm going to open the BlackBerry software which reads the MEP code for the BlackBerry. It's the BlackBerry SP called BlackBerry Smart 2. Right. <clears throat> you can see a couple of tabs down there at the bottom. So this is the tab I have to use, Do Job. So I click Do Job, and straight away it says, attach a USB now. So I'm going to attach a USB cable with this. Uh, make sure you don't select the mass storage menu. You have to uncheck it. Click now. Do you want to turn on mass storage mode? Click now on it. And you can see the software straight away reads the IMEI number, 
and it has taught it to calculate the MEP1, MEP2, and so on, the chords. Yeah. Uh, this is the MEP2 code which we need in the number 2. I'm going to enter in the BlackBerry. So now I'm going to tell you how to enter this code, MEP2. That is for the network. The first is SIM, then network, then network subset, and then service provider, then corporate. So the one I need is network network code. Yeah, I'm going to enter. For that, I need to go on to the phone's menu once again. So I open options, advanced options, SIM card, and I click M E P. Then I press Alt 2. Yeah. And it has given me a space to enter the MEP code. Yeah. So let's see on the system. It's 7004190411864451. So once I've entered, I'm going to press the menu inside it says code accepted so now this blackberry is unlocked you can see all the codes all the spaces it says disabled all the codes have been disabled so this blackberry is no longer logged to t-mobile it's ready to go all networks it's gsm that was a tutorial about blackberry thank you